Hello everyone, welcome to Pandey Guruji YouTube channel. In this video, I will continue uh, providing you the SQL practice set. So, I already provided the total video of 28. So, you can find all the complete video under the uh, playlist uh, SQL practice exercise with the solution and uh, also under the SQL interview question. So, uh, today I will discuss a uh, very important uh, common question. So basically this question is uh, frequently asked uh, by the interviewer. So the question is the uh, write a SQL query to print uh, number 1 to 100 uh, using the while loop, CTE and the cursor. So if you provide the answer by using the while loop, uh, the interviewer will ask you how you can achieve this requirement uh, by using the CTE and the cursor. So I will provide you the same uh, solution by using the different way. First I will discuss how we can achieve by the while loop. The second is the CTE and the third one is the cursor. So if you have uh, understanding of the while loop, if you have the understanding of the CTE, uh, recursive CTE and then cursor and then only you able to achieve this type of the question. So uh, by using this video, you will get very clear understanding uh, of the CT, uh, of the recursive CT and also the cursor. So uh, before starting this video uh, to solution of this question, uh, if you uh, practice the complete SQL training uh, and uh, you can visit uh, studyiteducation.com. You can also find the link on the video description. Uh, you just you can click on this all courses and uh, here you can see the complete of the uh, interview question, training material, uh, the SQL, all the notes available under this training material, in video, uh, practice the interview question. If you want to learn the SQL one to one uh, live, okay, so I will, I'm also providing the training on the SQL part. So uh, as soon as possible, you can enroll the courses. So uh, let's start with how you can achieve this type of the uh, answer. So first I will discuss uh, about uh, how we can achieve by using the uh, while loop. So basically the, the uh, we have to need to be uh, print 1 to 100. So you need to be loop by, by 1 to 100. So uh, to perform the while loop, the basic concept is the where the loop will be start and the well loop will be end okay so uh, let me declare two variable okay i'm declaring one variable a integer and second variable i'm declaring b uh, integer and i'm setting the uh, value as a set uh, a is equal to set a is equal to one because the starting number is the one and the ending number should be hundred so where you need to be start and where need to be uh, end so the developer is doing mistake in the interview they hard coding the value uh, in the while loop okay so that is the reason that is, this is not the good uh, uh, sql practice okay so uh, basically uh, you can just uh, use the while loop and you need to be put the condition at the rate a equal less than equal to okay so basically when this condition will be satisfied uh, less than equal to b so basically some type of the student they're doing they hard code the 100 here so this is not the sql good practice and this will be very bad impact in front of the interviewer so try to use the always the variable okay so now a is less than equal to b a have the value one and the we have the hundred now we need to be use the uh, begin transaction and uh, uh, end okay so this is the begin and end of the while loop so we have we need to be print the a value okay so simple you need to be print the a statement okay and uh, just you can again set a equal to uh, a plus one if you not put this type of the condition then the then the while loop got infinite so first time they print a and they increment the second value when 100 printed and one one zero one will be value will be there for a and uh, b is equal to 100 this statement got false and the uh, loop will be stop executing here okay so now if you run this code now you can see it's printing uh, 1 to 100 okay so now you can see it's printing 1 to 100 
सो दिस इज अ वेरी सिंपल वे वाइल्ड लूप ओके बट हाउ वी कैन अचीव बाय यूजिंग द सी टी ओके सो सी टी इज द बेसिकली इज द कॉमन टेबल एक्सप्रेशन सो आई हैव द कोड सो लेट मी प्लेस द कोड हेयर सो दे वी नॉट वेस्ट द टाइम टाइमिंग सो वी एक्सप्लेन ऑन द कंप्लीट ओके सो बेसिकली सी टी इज द कॉमन टेबल एक्सप्रेशन सो सी टी इज ऑलवेज स्टार्ट विद द विथ क्लॉज विथ सी टी वी गिवेन द दिस इज द सी टी इज द सी टी नेम यू कैन गिव द एनी नेम ओके लाइक प्रिंट ए बी सी समथिंग एंड एज सो वी सेलेक्टिंग वन एज ए नंबर वन सो दिस इज द बेसिकली इज ए कॉलम नेम ओके सो बेसिकली दिस इज द कॉलम एलियाज नेम इज देयर यू कैन पुट एनी नम एनी नेम ऑल्सो लाइक एक्स वाई जेड ए बी सी एंड वी डूइंग द यूनियन ऑल सो बेसिकली यूनियन इज बेसिकली जस्ट मर्जिंग द टू डिजल सेट सो बेसिकली वेन वी सेलेक्ट दिस वन दे विल प्रिंट वन एंड देन नेक्स्ट वन वी इंक्रीमेंटिंग द वेल्यू वन वन प्लस वन सो नाउ वी हैव द दिस इज द कॉल द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ द रिकर्सिव सिटी विद इन द सिटी वी कॉलिंग द सिटी एंड वेयर नंबर इज लेस देन इक्वल टू लेस देन ओनली हंड्रेड ओके सो टिल द हंड्रेड विल बी देयर इट विल बी प्रिंट सो आफ्टर द सिटी क्लोज यू नीड टू बी कॉल द सिटी अदरवाइज सिटी इज गॉड फेल्ड सो बेसिकली सिटी विल स्टोर इन द मेमोरी सो वेन यू प्लेस सम अदर स्टेटमेंट लाइक सिलेक्ट आर फ्रॉम लाइक टेबल नेम एम दी गिविंग डीम करेंसी और डीम अकाउंट सो डीम दिस डीम अकाउंट इज नॉट रिलेटेड टू दिस सिटी सो यू कैन सी दिस इज रेड हाईलाइटेड एंड द सिटी विल नॉट वर्क ओके सो यू हैव द कॉन्सेप्ट लाइक वेन एवर द सिटी इज क्रिएटेड यू नीड टू बी टेक द एक्शन आइडर सेलेक्ट आइडर डिलीट और आइडर अपडेट सो नाउ इफ यू नाउ इफ यू एग्जीक्यूट दिस पार्ट ऑफ द कोड यू कैन सी वन टू हंड्रेड इज प्रिंटिंग ओके सो वी हेयर इज शोइंग दियर वी बिकॉज वी सेलेक्टिंग हेयर द वेल्यू सो इज इज शोइंग अंडर दिस समथिंग द नंबर इज द फॉर्मेट लाइक यू नीड टू यू नीड टू बी हैव द ग्रीड फॉर्मेट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू शो इन द टेक्सट फॉर्मेट लाइक द प्रीवियस यू कैन सेलेक्ट द टेक्सट फॉर्मेट एंड देन यू कैन सेल एंड देन यू कैन सेलेक्ट इट so now you can see this is printing in the text format okay so you can change the property now the third third one is the very little bit uh, complex okay because we have the cursor okay so cursor have the life cycle okay so i already discussed in the detail uh, what is the cursor is there and the cursor is also the an alternate way of the looping okay so uh, you need to be uh, full uh, have the understanding of the object then only you need you can achieve any type of the requirement so uh, let me put the code for the cursor and i'll explain one by one okay so uh, first life cycle we need to be uh, declare the cursor second one is the uh, fetch the cursor uh, then we need to be uh, close the cursor and then deallocate the cursor this is the cursor life cycle so i am declaring one variable uh, that is the tv table so this is the nothing but a table variable will be there okay so i already discussed the concept of the table variable so we have different different way uh, you can achieve through the cursor you can directly loop through the cursor as well you can assign the value so uh, basically i am discussing here the by using the table variable and inserting into this table variable by using the select zero and a uh, declaring variable v1 and uh, i'm starting the cursor my cursor name is cur and uh, uh, for select from this table okay so i'm fetching the next value in, from the cursor and this is the fetch state is not equal to minus 1 we just setting is equal to uh, v is equal to b plus 1 okay b zero we have uh, zero like okay so we already have the v1 is where is value is a zero so i'm incrementing one and if uh, v is equal to 100 v1 is equal to 100 we breaking okay so basically when the we reach to 100 the print this will be break and that they will go to the uh, close the cursor and they will deallocate the cursor so now if you run this part of the code okay so now if you run this part of the code you can see uh, it printing 1 to 100 only okay so if you have any question if you have any doubt 
so just you can learn uh, basically if you have a requirement to in the real time you can simply use the while loop uh, while loop is very clear and cut okay so if you have understanding so you, uh, you you enjoy the using the while loop okay so because this this is the very uh, good uh, concept okay so very simple and clear and cut will be there so as per our understanding you can use the while loop but for the interview point of view you can you need to be learn the CTE you need to be learn the cursor I already provided the complete detail and still if you have any question uh, if you have any doubt you can put the question on the video description and if you not enroll in my courses just you can enroll it so thank you so much for watching this video we'll meet again on next video thank you